was first asked to join this project, I was very shy and always uh, shy away. Uh, later on, uh, because this project has got five women in this project, uh, we got to meet up. Uh, so we get to know each other. We have uh, fun and laughter. And uh, we did everything together. Even the quilt also we did together. Uh, it's uh, very enjoyable and and it gives me some uh, memory of uh, the days when we were together to do the things. My, my meeting with Fong, the first time was, I, my feeling was, I find that she's so strong. Even with a half body, she can still survive that long. You know, uh, where we, with the, uh, the whole body intact, sometimes we also find frustration and uh, want to give up ourselves, but you no, know, with uh, thinking of her, we will, we will still push on you know, to uh, to make our lives better. The first time I met Nisha and Salasri, uh, I also really um, uh, admire them. You know, uh, with as a transgender, uh, with so much. Uh, People looking down on them and uh, uh, still they try to make their lives uh, easy you know, and to be accepted by the, uh, the community, you know. I have been afraid of cameras and computers all these years. It's because I find uh, uh, doing the old way, like what I'm doing in SLE, the uh, on the accounts book is much easier than using the computer because whenever you click, suddenly some some other things appear and they are lost. <laughs> The project team told me to use the camera for several times, but I still not. I'm still not so good with it. Still uh, struggling on which button and where and how to press. <laughs> I am actually a shy person who has not been on any camera because I don't even have a camera myself. But after joining in with this uh, portrait of perseverance. Every now and then, the camera is running after me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm <just> so irritated. <laughs> I really don't like it. I I think I have phobia on the camera already. <laughs> if just now is alive and sitting in front of me. I would say a big thank you to her for actually uh, improving my life and uh, learning more things. Uh, and be more uh, optimistic to go forward in life uh, with now the new gadgets of her. Uh, camera, handphone, with all the SMS and uh, so hopefully I can pick up with more of this uh, new technology. Miss uh, Morgan, I knew her when I joined this Portrait of Perseverance. She's our cameraman. She went everywhere to take photos of me. Even in my 
uh, family gathering, she also went. We also, uh, she was also my roommate on my Cambodia trip. <laughs> She's a nice girl to be with and easy to get along. She came with me to Kajang to photograph me <laughs> of my uh, daily chores, which is uh, part of the Portrait of Perseverance. Uh, so after the taking photograph of me at home, uh, I took her to Kajang to have satay, which is the best in Malaysia, and she enjoyed it. She wanted to go now the second time, but didn't make it because it was the day when we went in the evening. The office crowd at night, uh, office after office hour, the crowd was too great. We had to push it ourselves into the train, <laughs> and that actually scared her. She went on two stations. The third station, she left and then turned back home. <laughs> I'm going to miss her with all the her jokes, her laughter. Uh, actually, she's a, a fun girl to be with. You know? She's easy going, and she she's uh, she can try anything. She's not a trying of anything, though she's not a Malaysian, you know? but she tries everything. Even like Cambodia, she took the cricket, in which I never took any. 